What is going on everybody? This is Mike with Terrible Gaming and it's finally here. Heroes of the Storm 2.0 is officially live. It's been live for about 5 minutes. It's uh, 12.04 right now and I think it went live at about yeah, at about noon. So about 4 minutes it's been live. Uh, I just loaded it up, got everything uh, going. Uh, so right here you can see the progression system. Uh, it's just showing like just the basic progression system for how this new progression system works. Um, so it's going to have the player level which is just uh, all of your character levels put together. Here it'll have hero levels just the same, and um, the loot chests will be earned for uh, each level that you increase your uh, character as well as your hero. If that makes sense? I don't know. Maybe I said that backwards. But for each category, you'll get be getting loot boxes uh, at different increments. You'll be getting better loot boxes. Uh, you'll be getting uh, skins, uh, heroes, mounts, and tons more. So the heroes is pretty cool. I didn't realize that originally in the 2.0. Uh, in the in the PTR version, I didn't realize that you actually got heroes out of there, so that's that's really cool. Um, and then, uh, so I'm just gonna go ahead and hit next here. Uh, and one quick thing to go over as well is um, don't forget about uh, we have a community play day to celebrate our three months of being on YouTube. Uh, we're gonna be playing this Heroes of the Storm 2.0. Uh, we'll be playing that this Saturday, uh, April 29th. So it'll be at seven o'clock. We'll be doing it live. You guys can come play with us. Um, and uh, yeah, it'll be all live live streaming. So if you want to play with us, just let us know. We can do some custom games or whatever we feel like doing. Uh, okay, and then here is the gems. So there's the new currency of gems. Uh, so you purchase them with real money, use them to unlock heroes, um, and uh, purchase uh, featured items in your collection. And then there's the gold, which is just like before, um, and then shards, which you can use to unlock cosmetic items, which is which is pretty cool. I, I like that there's three currencies. Um, it might get a little bit confusing with uh, so many currencies, but I guess we'll see. Progression update. Uh, my total hero level is 40, uh, 143. So I, I guess anything over 100 is your rank here. I don't know. So five loot chests awarded. Next reward. 14 epic chests. Holy cow. One veteran chest. Veteran hero portrait, which is cool. 30 day stim pack, nice. Wow, that was a lot of stuff. Um, oh yes, and so uh, so right now I don't know when it goes uh, when it goes through, but they're doing this thing where uh, you get 100 free gems to purchase a mega bundle, uh, which contains 20 heroes. So super cool. I'm super excited about this. So um, so there's the assassins mega bundle. It literally comes with all these characters. Like it, it's a ton of characters. Um, so in this one, I already have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten people uh, out of this one. So I'll be getting ten, ten heroes out of it. Um, this is probably the one that I'm going to be going with because I've been playing a lot of Zul'jin, but I don't own him. Um, the uh, Falstead is awesome. Tychus, I enjoy him. Lunara, I've been wanting to play as because she just seems super, uh, super OP. Um, uh, but let's see. Let's go to let's go to the next one here. The Flex Bundle. Uh, this one has Varian, Abathur, Diablo, which I already have. But um, this one also has Zul'jin and Tychus, which is pretty cool. Um, Zul'jin is one of my primary ones that I want to get. So actually, this might, might not be a bad one for me. Um, support and Specialist. Um, lots of good people in here. Chen, uh, Tassiter, Lucio. Um, uh, Tyrael, so that's cool too. Dahaka. Not exactly my uh, my cup of tea, really, for that one. But uh, Tanks and Bruisers, this one is another one that uh, I think is going to be pretty good. Uh, Artanis, Leoric, Nubarak, um, Chen, Ragnaros, which is one that I really, really want. But uh, I'm still thinking that Assassin's Bundle is going to have more people that I, that I really want. Um, because we got, yeah, Tracer, Zeratul. Falstead, Tychus, Lunara. Yeah, so I think I'm going to actually go with... Um, man, I don't know, though. The other ones, I get so many more people. With this one, I'm getting, like, 16 people, because I only have four of them. This is a this is a tough call right now. Um, but I don't really think I'm going to be using a lot of these people, except for maybe Ragnaros. So let's go ahead and I'm just going to go with that Assassin's Bundle because I know that I'll use a few of those people. So let's go ahead and purchase the Assassin's Bundle. Uh, pay now with 
the gems. Boom, there we go. And apparently Zeratul breakdances, which is interesting. Alright, so let's go back to the collection here. See, and then once you get the bundle, that's the only bundle you get. So, you're, if you don't like your... You better make sure that you really like your bundle if you're going to go that route. Um, so let's just... Let's open these loot chests. Why not? So, let's see. Looks like all common stuff. Portrait, some emojis. That's fine. Next one. We got a rare in this one. Uh, New Barak skin, which is... Oh, that's actually a pretty cool skin. I like that a lot. Another rare. Oh, Greymane's Ringmaster skin. Yes. Another rare. Uh, Murky's rare skin. That's cool. I don't have Murky, but that's fine. One day. Oh, uh, Rhaegar. Nice. Okay. And that's all the regular loot chests. So, the epic loot chests. Now, these ones are going to be... These ones are going to be cool. So, let's see. We've got the common here. The rare, which is uh, Johanna. Epic. Oh, and then the uh, little heart mount. <laughs> nice. Okay, um, let's go do another one. Epic. Oh, I got two epics in this one. Sergeant Hammer uh, skin. Epic. And then uh, I don't really, I don't really use her very much, but that's okay. At least I'll have the skin. I still have 12 more of these things. Epic. Oh, uh, Ar Ar Arthas as the uh, battle announcer. That's cool. Uh, Asmodan skin. Got two rares in this one. Oh, nice. Butcher. Which I, I actually use Butcher. Epic. Oh, and uh, yeah, uh, Muradin. Nice. Ooh, legendary. Legendary. Ooh, demonic Ariel. <laughs> That's pretty cool. And then you'll notice too at the bottom it gives me the option to re-roll um, after we open them all. Um, and that's for like if I get something that I just don't really care about, um, I can re-roll it. Oh, this is I've been wanting this one. It's really horrifying. The clown on the top here is just not super pleasant to look at. Oh, I got Butcher as a hero, but uh, I already have him, so I get 100 uh, shards. Uh, should I re-roll that? Yeah, you know what? I'm going to re-roll it. Why not? Uh, let's see. I got the Tarande or whatever her name is. Uh, another Sergeant Hammer skin. Kind of wonder if I should, if this is telling me I should start playing as Sergeant Hammer, because... Uh, Seem to be getting a lot of those skins. Epic. Lily epic skin. That's cool. 20 shards. I didn't realize that those came in here. Then uh, Ringmaster Greyman. So I got another variation of the other one. The other one was the fancy Ringmaster. So let's see. Okay. Epic. There we go. Uther. Don't really use Uther, but that's okay. Uh, Tyrael. Oh, I got. Oh, I actually got the hero. That's cool. I'll take a hero. Uh, Iron Claw Rhaegar. That's kind of cool. Let's see. Let's let's actually re-roll this one because I don't care about Rhaegar. I'm not gonna probably end up using him. So let's re-roll. Got two, uh, two epics in this one. The epic snake, uh, snake mount. Oh, demon hunter Valera. That is cool. 
See, and as, it, as you keep re-rolling, it increases the amount that it costs to re-roll. Ooh, brown direwolf. That's pretty cool. Uh, so I could re-roll this one, too, because I don't really care too much about the direwolf. Let's, let's do it. Another Sergeant Hammer skin. Ooh, Nazebo. <laughs> yes. The horrifying Nazebo. Which is nice. I actually do use Nazebo, so that'll be that'll be good. Uh, Nazebo's exact same skin again. Perfect. Uh, let's go ahead and we'll re-roll this one too since I got the same Nazebo. Oh, Diablo announcer. That's good. That's really cool, actually. I'm really happy about that. Gray main rare skin. Uh, Alarak. That's that is a super cool skin, but I'm going to re-roll it because I don't use an uh a new barak. Oh, we have two epic system. Morales, which I, I don't use Morales. Oh, but uh Moss Oni Genji skin, that's pretty cool. All right, now for the grand finale veteran chest. Let's see what's in this one. Ooh, let's see. Legendary. Oh, prime. Okay, I can't. Re I I want to re-roll this one just because I want to see what else I can get. But man, I've been wanting a sweet Diablo skin because he's my primary character. Uh, so I'm not going to re-roll this as much as I really want to because I want to see what else you can get in this. I am going to actually keep this one, I think. Uh, yeah, I'll keep it. That was super cool. Um, let's see. Collection. I got 77 stuff now. Uh, let's actually go to... Let's go to here. Let's go to my Diablo who is level 11 now. That's pretty cool. Um, when I, Before this, he was only level 9, so he increased by... By uh, two levels, just from how the XP changes. Uh, same with Nazebo. So Nazebo was the same thing. I think Stitches was level eight when, when I was playing before. But my uh, my Butcher definitely wasn't fifteen. I think he was like ten, like maybe a little bit over ten. Um, okay, so let's check out that Diablo skin I just got. Oh my gosh, that is a incredibly cool skin. Look at. Like, why, why is he so thin? Is this like a, a female Diablo, almost? Because it looks like he might have a little chichis there. But, uh, yeah, let's see. Uh, that is a that is an incredibly cool skin. I'm really happy with that. Um, I don't see any variants for it either here. Yeah, I don't, I don't see any variants. Uh, for that skin, which is kind of interesting, too. Uh, um, let's see. Let's let's use the, the heart one, too. That's pretty cool. We use the Zerg banner. And then default and answer. No, we're going to use Diablo. So he's announcing his own match. That is a seriously cool skin. I am very, very happy with that. So yeah, so I have tons of things in my collection now. Um, I'm not going to go through all the different things that I got because there's so many things. Um, but real quick though, let's let's go in and let's look at the different skins that we have because I've been wanting one for... Uh, let's actually let's let's look at Diablo. Actually, no, I want the Falstead um, legendary. I've been really wanting one of these. So, how much do they cost? They cost sixteen hundred shards. So, I have eighty. <laughs> I, have, I have a little bit to go to get those, but we'll be uh, receiving loot boxes and all that good stuff too. So that'll be nice. Um, and I still have thirteen thousand uh, gold, so I can reroll boxes. Yeah, and I can unlock characters with the gold. Four thousand gold for Nubarak. All this stuff here. Um, Ragnaros still ten thousand, or I could use my sh uh, my uh, gems, which might not be a bad idea because I do have a thousand. Um, but before I do any of that stuff, I want to make sure that I know for sure what I can spend my gems on and all that good stuff. 
But anyways, uh, that's pretty much going to do it for this the video. I just kind of wanted to show off the uh, just the basic like me opening up the chests and, and starting up the game. So you can kind of see what to expect with the veterans chests and all that good stuff. Just to give like some sort of uh, you know baseline for what you're to expect when you uh, when you actually get in the game. But anyways, um, if you enjoyed this video, give it a like. Subscribe to our channel for more videos, including some Overwatch 2.0, uh, which we'll be playing. Or I'm sorry, not Overwatch. Heroes of the Storm 2.0. Um, so, you know, it, just keep keep watching. We'll be playing some uh, Heroes of the Storm 2.0 in the next, you know, probably for the rest of eternity because we're kind of addicted to this game. Um, and we and don't forget about the Community Play Day, April 29th, 7 p.m. Pacific. Um, we'll be doing that. You can come play with us. We'll be giving away. Uh, we have a T-shirt to give away. We have possibly some other stuff. I don't want to. I don't want to give anything, give anything out right now. But uh, but yeah, we'll have some cool surprises and stuff for you. So until next time, I've been Mike with Terrible Gaming, and you have yourself a terrible day. Thank you so much for watching and supporting our channel. If you enjoyed this video, click right here for our latest upload, or click right here for another episode, and click our channel icon in the middle to subscribe.